Alrighty, so Ashley, you have this, and while very cute, the bubble manatee doesn't really work. So if you click on it, and oh, first I deleted, um, I went to the sewing order, and um, you had all the, I'm going to combine these while I'm here. Anyway, um, yeah, see, I can't stop playing with it, sorry. I'm going to drag these down to win. And this one, and this one, and this one. Oh, wow, that's a lot of them. All right, hang on. I'm gonna click off. I'm gonna click on there, and then I'm gonna go to hold shift down, and then drag them there. Okay, so I deleted. You had like the little outliney ones, so that's fine. Um, so I'm gonna click on fight, and I'm gonna change this from manatee to solid. Okay, so I know it doesn't look like applique now, but just trust me, this is the other font doesn't actually work. So then go to text, convert to outline, and you get those little teeny dotted line thingies. I'm gonna click this just because it makes it easier. And here we'll change the sewing attributes. Oh, it is already at 16. Um, so that you can see what it actually is gonna look like when you have the satin stitch in. And you can see when I zoom in on it that um, so now each letter is in individual. So I'm going to move them over, we'll move that up, and move all of these over, and move these guys, and then move that guy, there we go. And look at, you can enlarge it just slightly, what's it at, 496, alrighty. Okay, so then we're going to save it. Slowly. Okay, we're going to file, import it, and would you just call this Cheer Fight Win? Thinking, 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 and blinky. There we go. So, order. We want just the fight. Um, here, we're going to actually, let's click on this one, and this one, cancel, and, oh, I can't reach delete. Sorry, hitting delete. So then we'll go to sew and order and move this one over here. Okay, fine or not. So here's all your fight letters. We want them in order. F and then F and then I dot and I dot go over. I dot and I dot and then moving those together. G and G. Sorry, itch. <laughs> oh, G middle. H and T. Okay, so then this one, and this one, and command in that one, and command in that one, command in that one, command, and command. Okay, then we hit OK. So now it has just those letters selected. We're going to go to sew, oopsie, attribute settings, and put this at 10 and this at 25 and hit apply so that is going to do now that little I don't know everyone calls it a foundation stitch whatever so it foundation stitches across the top woohoo okay getting closer and then we save slowly and then file import a third time and what is it oh yeah that one I'll get it sooner or later So, order, don't want this one, don't want this one, and then we only need one of each, of course, uh, this guy. So I'm going to get rid of all of these, and I'm just holding command down and um, clicking on them, and I hit cancel, and then delete, which I can't do with one hand. Okay, so then we click on it, so applique wizard. There we go. And then go to sewing order. So now this is your applique. So sure, we'll just make it black for now. You can change the color later. Um, so your outline is black. Then it has a tack down, and then it has this one. But again, you need to change this one. Go to sewing order, whatever that was said, attributes 04 and 25. So now if you zoom me way in, you have 
outline in black, which you can barely see is right there. Then the tack down and the zigzag. Pretty cool, huh? Sound effects help. And then you go to the next one. Oopsie, not that. Go back. Button. Okay, so then we go sewing. <laughs> applique wizard. No, okay. And then this one. So, applique wizard. No, and okay. So, that is, I did both of them at the same time. Um, and then I'm just moving. Um, wait. <laughs> so these are my outlines. Yeah, this is why I only do one letter at a time because I tend to get confused and I've done it a bazillion times. And those need to still be black. <laughs> and then, so then it goes tack down and then zigzaggy around it. So we're going to change these zigzaggies to the, whatever that was, 04. Five. Five. And I know it's complicated right now, but it's only because you have lots of letters. If you do it one letter at a time, it's not nearly as tough. So look, we have F I. Ooh, if you want to go Fi win, you could delete the rest. Yeah, never mind, I'm an idiot. So anyway, you continue on like that. I'm not going to show you all of them, but you get it. Bye bye.